Wow, what we have here, this is the biggest river catfish, Pangasianodon hypothalamus, that I have ever seen. This fish weighs almost 70 pounds and is almost five feet in length. It's a really a huge fish, beautiful fish. This fish is also known as the iridescent shark catfish because of its shape. It's shaped a little bit like a shark and sometimes when it swims on the surface, it'll raise its dorsal fin and it'll look quite a bit like a shark as it swims along. Uh, this fish was caught here in the Tonle Sap River in Cambodia and uh, these fish move out of the Tonle Sap Lake every year and into the Mekong River, uh, we believe, to, to complete their spawning migration, to complete their life cycle. The head on this thing is the same size as my head, and this almost rivals the size of some of the smaller Mekong giant catfish that I've seen. Uh, these fish have a very delicate skin, no scales, and they have a slime layer that protects them from infection. We're tagging and releasing these fish to learn about their behavior. So this fat fish has an individual numbered tag. It's fish 3,385. So this is uh, the 3,000th fish that we've tagged in the last four years. And what we're doing is we release these fish back into the Tonle Sap River so they can continue their migration. And then if a fisherman somewhere downstream catches this fish again, we learn where, where it's moved by this individual identification number. So now we've uh, oh. now we're in the middle of the river. We want to release this fish away from the bank so that uh, it doesn't get caught again, and also want to make sure it can swim on its own. I'm gonna hop in. Oh, seems to be swimming pretty well. Really nice big fish. Just needs a few seconds to get acclimated to the river water again. He's trying. So we released the fish and uh, it disappeared and then we just saw it jump once and then go back down. So that's all we can do. Hopefully it'll make it.